Hello, welcome to another episode of Ray Eden's Magic in Helsinki. Today we're visiting the Gorkea Sari Zoo, which means the High Island Zoo. And this is the, uh, the only zoo uh, in the Helsinki area. And um, it's maybe, what, 10, 15 minutes outside of city center. And you can get here by ferry. We'll show you the ferry landing a little bit later. And uh, you can get here by car. There's parking, free parking and pay parking. But uh, now let's go ahead and start into the zoo and see what animals we can find here. <laughs> Have wild boar. Uh, I do believe that uh, the wild boar is native to Finland, and you know, we even find them in the wild here from time to time. Uh huh. Squealers. So we're at the bear enclosure. Where are the bears? See if we can find the bears. There they are. Right down in the corner there. 
They look like they're sleeping. There's the bears. Let's see if we can get a close up on on the bears. There they are. They look like they're very happily sleeping in a nice cool spot, keeping out of the heat. The sleeping bears. I guess we're not here at a very active time of day. Oh, oh they just moved. Scratching himself. <laughs> bear's got to do what a bear's got to do. has really nice access for wheelchairs so you can get around here and get to the uh, exhibits even if you're in a wheelchair makes it very nice not having much luck at the uh, cat enclosures today uh, haven't seen the uh, the Bobcat the uh, the Paulus's cat the um, well there was one other one uh, that that's here but I think it's just too hot today for these cats to want to be out I don't blame them
This is a red panda eating something or the other. They're sort of like a raccoon. The red panda has an extra thumb on its paw, which makes eating easier. Sounds like a good thing since it looks like that's all this thing is doing is eating. Uh, what we're seeing here is European wood deer and uh, they're a relative of the uh, reindeer. They're a cousin. But the horns look very much like a reindeer. But they might be bigger. These antlers might be bigger. If you look over here, I think that might be some babies over there. And that might be a, a doe. I know it's a moose. He's not very easy to see, but there his tail's wagging a little bit. There's a tiger there, way in the back. Let's see if we can get this any clearer. There, can you see the tiger? There he is. You see his tail and his leg wagging there. That is the closest we've seen to a cat all day long. The mighty tiger sleeping. Finally seeing some cats. The lion is doing its normal thing and just laying there. And this is why they call him the Lion King because all he has to do is sit there and sleep. In the lion prize it's actually the female lions that go out and do the hunting. The males stay at home. This is the area where the ferry will drop you off when you're coming to the zoo. Uh, the ferry starts in Helsinki and uh, this is where it will bring you. So uh, here are the prices for the ferry. Uh, an adult uh, round trip ticket is seven euros and a one way is uh, three and a half euros. And it seems children under the age of 17 get to ride for free. So. That makes us a real nice way uh, to spend a day with the family. 
with the kids riding for free. You'll see behind here, one of the first things you're greeted with is a souvenir shop. Uh, I just wanted to mention that although I've shown you a lot of the animals that are here at the Helsinki Zoo, I haven't shown you all of them. Uh, for instance, I haven't shown you these until now. There's a lot of other animals here. And when you come, make sure to give yourself enough time. We only have like four hours and we're not seeing everything. Give yourself the day when you come to this park and enjoy all that it has to offer. Okay. Okay. We're gonna do some magic. Okay. I'm gonna give you each one of these. I guess you've seen one of these before. Yes. Yeah. It's a rubber band. Yes. It's very exciting. Yes. <laughs> it's also extremely magical. Okay. It is. I'm gonna show you one of the very first pieces of magic that I learned when I was a child, and this is what it looks like. Watch the hands, because those rubber bands they go through the fingers right like that yeah okay <laughs> I said this I learned when I was a little kid okay we're gonna do it a little bit different we're gonna put that here like this and we're gonna put this here like this and I'm gonna lock them together like this okay all right so now it will still go right through the fingers yes into Thanks. there okay. look we're gonna take this a step further have you ever heard of David Copperfield? Yes. yes. I'm going to show you the trick David Copperfield taught me. Okay. I'm lying. <laughs> Watch. Those are locked there, yes. correct? They're locked there. Yes. They're locked there. Yeah, locked there. Watch. Watch, watch, watch. Come in real close with that camera and watch as that melts right Whoa. through, right like that. Wow. Yeah. That's for you? Yeah, keep it. And that's for you to keep? Yeah. And that's for you? It's real much. And there you go. There you go. I will, I know what I'm going to be doing next to you. <laughs> Thank you very oh, much. Awesome. I hope you enjoyed the magic. Thank you, awesome. Thank you very much. Awesome. Thank you. <laughs> okay. So, that was our uh, time at uh, the Helsinki Zoo today. Hope you had some fun seeing the animals that we saw. Unfortunately, it was a little bit of a warm day and so a lot of the animals weren't out just simply because the weather wasn't something they liked. But we did see, uh, we did end up seeing the lion, we did end up seeing the tiger, and hey, we're ending with the camels. So uh, that makes me think that it's time for some water. It's been a long day. But if you like the video, please take a moment to subscribe, like the video, and remember to click that bell icon so that you'll receive notifications 
whenever I upload new content. Again, thank you for watching this episode of Magic in Helsinki. Until next time, have fun. It's stretching. <laughs>